taking a look at the CAC A2 buttstock. That's right, you heard correct. That is CAC. And this is my tiny little cuckoo from Condor 309. I forgot I had this knife and I saw it on the screen. I pull it out to cut this, cut this pipe open since I haven't used this knife in a while. And it actually is, was my favorite knife at one point for quite some time. Alright, let's see how this thing is sealed up. Is it screwed? I think it's like rubber material. Hold on, I don't want the buffer and spring to go flying out. Let me check this backside out. Damn, this thing is stiff. Does it go up? No. Let me see. Yep, definitely down. Oh, that is tight. I gotta use both hands for this, so I'll do it off camera. <clears throat> Let me get it to focus in right here so you can see a close up. So I'll be testing out. Oh, these are the wrong springs. These are for the silent capture. This is for the spring co. And we're gonna do a Noveski um, rifle buffer. We'll test out the Sprinko rifle spring. And give me one second. Also test the JP custom buffer spring. So we've got the Sprinko green rifle spring. And then we got the JP spring and the Noveski buffer with the CAC stock. This will go on the LMT. It came all contained by this little green cap. I YouTubed a bunch of stuff. I couldn't find anything on these CAC um, A2 butt stocks. So I'm going to show you guys what you get, how it feels. It does feel very solid. I'm sure it's going to contain everything just fine. 